What's up ghouls, it's Blaze and welcome back to my channel. Um, sorry that I look a mess in this video. Um, originally I wasn't supposed to film today. I had three pre-recorded videos um, on the computer, one of which was edited, one was partway edited and the other one was just raw footage. And then for some beautiful reason, the computer decided to delete my whole YouTube folder. So I don't have any any footage left at all, I couldn't recover it, I don't know what the hell happened, I tried, my boyfriend tried, we couldn't recover the footage, we couldn't even find that it even existed on the computer anywhere, it wasn't in the recycle bin, checked there, it just was gone, I don't know what the hell happened, but, so I've lost all of my YouTube stuff, I had all my old videos saved on there, old thumbnails, I had stuff saved to start making like a, a blooper video, everything's gone, so good times, love my life. So yeah, so have nothing recorded. So today a video was supposed to go out that I did have, now I don't, so I'm here recording again. Um, it is currently 20 to nine at night. <laughs> I'm tired, I've been out all day. I've been in this makeup for probably about 11 hours now. It's not good. You can see like all this redness here. My contour's just muddy. I'm a mess, so yeah. So today's video is a little chit chat video, this again is one I recorded before so I might miss some of the points, but hopefully not. Anyway, it's a chit chat video about why I was gone from YouTube, I wasn't gone that long, I don't think it was hugely noticeable, but I have a upload schedule of every Tuesday and every Saturday and I missed that for a while and the videos were just going up sporadically because I've been super freaking busy so this is just a little video to explain why and to just say for definite my upload schedule is every tuesday and every saturday and it's tuesday today so i'm recording this i'm gonna edit it and get it out before it hits midnight that is the mission <laughs> so yeah so the main reasons why i've been away is first of all i've been working a lot over the past month of june yeah <laughs> over june i worked a lot of hours because we had loads of deliveries coming in there's not that many staff that work at the store I work at. There's only five of us, maybe six. I think five with one cover girl that doesn't really cover. <laughs> um, yeah, so there's five or six of us that work there. And there's only really two people per shift, a maximum of three, but when people are on holiday and they need overtime and blah, 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 stuff like that. So I work a lot of hours and have done recently. So that's one of the main reasons I've been away. My shifts are half nine to half five. So, although now there's till six, anyway, so that's like the main chunk of the day gone and then by the time I get home we've had dinner, chilled out, you know, it's late and I'm either tired or, I don't know, I just don't want to film after a long day at work. So yeah, that's why I haven't had loads of great content going up recently. The videos I've uploaded have been like unboxings and stuff like that because they're just you know quick and easy to do so that's why there hasn't been a huge amount of creative fun content i did upload the rarity tutorial but i'm not happy with the quality of it so i'm going to be redoing that at some point yeah so that's the first reason the second reason was my dad went in for knee replacement surgery i don't remember if it was end of may or beginning of june not quite sure but um his knee had been really painful for a long time and he needed it's like a full knee replacement um, so it's quite a big surgery, so he did that in a hospital about 45 minutes away from where I live now. So um, when he first had it done, I went to see him every day for the first week while he was in hospital and then when he was released and then he was back in his house. So I went to see him every day for a week. Then after that, I'd see him like twice a week and then now I see him every couple of weeks like I normally do so back into like a, a normal routine again but yeah so I had to help him out because obviously it was difficult to walk because he'd had a knee replacement so I had to make sure he was okay and stuff like that so alongside my normal job I was also looking after my dad so that's why I was extra busy and the third reason I've been super busy is because for the course that I'm on at university which is fashion styling for those of you that don't know I'm required to do 100 hours of work experience before the end of March 2018, which seems a long way off if you think about it, but um, I have to have those hours done and signed off and everything before the end of March, um, but I get super, super busy when I go back to uni in October. It is full on because I'm in my last year, so dissertation needs doing, final major project needs planning, loads and loads of things all at once, plus, in because I work in a fancy dress store, 
October is ridiculously busy so I'm just going to be super freaking busy so I was like I just want to get this work experience done so so far I've done 50 hours of my work experience by working on the university's magazine which is a non-style I'll link below if you're interested it's not that interesting <laughs> if you're not into fashion but it's kind of cool so if you want to check it out I'll link it below um, basically people just um, sent in their submissions for the issue I go through and edit them edit the the text or the the copy whatever you want to call it and then it goes onto the site that's all I do <laughs> not super fun but it got the hours done so I'm not bothered about that so those are the three reasons that I've been away that and obviously I moved flat but I think I'm pretty sure I've spoken about that in a previous video but the actual moving only took place over about a week so we're all like settled in and stuff now it's all good and um, the things you've missed while I've been away um, there's not that much to be honest like I said I've just been doing work and work experience and boring stuff so it's not like anything super exciting has happened but I do have two new tattoos since I don't know, during the rest of my life and um, it's uh, my first and second ever tattoo which I will show you now oh my god I can't even see on the viewfinder if that's in there we go so this was my first one it's two hands holding a little crystal ball thingy um, there's a similar one on Pinterest but my tattooist added a couple more bits so it's not exactly the same as someone's tattoo and then I have this one <laughs> that way you can see it and it was from her drag race flash which she had on show and I picked that because I thought it was cool and sassy and I only had that done today so it's still healing and stuff obviously I only had it done today um, yeah so that's pretty cool I've been wanting tattoos for so long but I either was well to be honest I was too scared to get them I'm not gonna lie but I'm gonna do a whole separate video on that again so yeah basically I was too scared for a long time and I didn't have any money and then um, my boyfriend's mum got me a tattoo voucher for Christmas so I was like I need to use it and it expired in June so I got my first tattoo and now I want <laughs> a million and like after I had that literally like two weeks later I booked another one and now I've had that one and now I'm going to book another one. <laughs> as soon as I get my wages, I'm going to book another one because oh, I'm obsessed. So yeah, that's the only thing you've really missed um, since I've been gone. That and I had my hair done today. Not that you can see any difference. Um, so my hair was half and half. It was half red, half black. If you're a loyal subscriber and you've been watching from a long time ago, I had that between October or November and about February. I had... Um, half and half hair um, and then I dyed over it black in February because it was a lot of upkeep and you know it's very difficult to style half and half hair if you want everything to be perfectly precise which that's what I wanted it to be and it didn't turn out like that and then I got fed up so I just dyed it black um, and I did used to have a full fringe if you remember from older videos but I've let that grow out so my fringe is about here and the last time I had my hair cut was November so, you know, that's that's quite a lot of growth. Um, yeah, so my hair, I didn't dye my hair again since February after I dyed it black. So it's had quite a long time of just faded out. So I had my natural roots that had come in. And then this half of my hair was kind of a bit orangey, gingery, light brownie where the, <laughs> the black on the red on the blonde had faded to like a really weird colour. And then this was just faded black. So I went to the hairdressers today to have it all evened out into one colour. As you can hopefully see, I'm just about one colour now. Um, and the plan is to then go back in a couple of weeks time, get it bleached all over and then I'm going a bright colour. But I'm not going to say what colour because I'm going to leave that for suspense. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to be going an uh, exciting colour very soon. Um, so that's the only thing you've missed really. Tattoos and changing my hair. Um, so yeah, I just want to say like some stuff that's coming up on this channel because like I said, the videos I've been uploading aren't super exciting but I have some cool stuff planned. So I've got another transformation-y cosplay makeup tutorial <laughs> costume video thing coming up soon. Again, I'm not going to say who that is because that makes it more exciting. So I have one of those coming up. Um, me and my boyfriend have recently been trying out different recipes and stuff like that, especially some vegetarian or vegan ones. So um, I'm going to film us making some of those to do those on my channel because, you know, it's kind of interesting. You guys might enjoy that. 
um, so that's coming up soon and also some outfit videos because the, um, the flat I live in, the gardens are so nice so I want to film it's a really weird noise right now. Um, I want to film in that like surrounding gardens and stuff like that because that would be pretty. So yeah, there's some outfit videos coming up and also like I mentioned, I'm going to be doing a video on um, my tattoos and experiences in that situation and then also one about my moving. So a couple of chatty videos, a couple of outfitty videos and then a couple of more creative makeup-y costume videos so that is all to come in the very near future because I have a bit more free time on my hands now I don't have any work experience planned until September my dad is much better so I'm not seeing him all the time um, I'm just working a lot of hours so I just need to find time around work to film like I'm doing now so everything should be good it should be back to my normal schedule so yeah I hope this video wasn't too rambly and long and boring um, yeah, <laughs> apologies if it is, but I just needed to, you know, bring everyone up to date with what's going on. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below, let me know how you're doing. Just say hey, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.